Hello friends, this is the second part of solved examples on complex numbers. Today we are going to solve few more examples based on complex numbers. First example, we have to show that minus 1 plus root 3i, the whole raised to 3 is a real number. So first, we are going to use a plus b whole raised to 3, that formula here. So minus 1 plus root 3i, this whole raised to 3 is equal to first term raised to 3 plus 3 into first term square into second term plus 3 into first term into second term square plus second term raised to 3. So, root 3 i this whole raised to 3. Minus 1 into minus 1 into minus 1. Minus 1 into minus 1 is plus 1. Plus 1 into minus 1 plus minus minus. So, it will become minus 1 plus 3 into minus 1 square is 1 into root 3 i plus minus minus 3 root 3 square is 3 root gets cancelled with the square i square plus root 3 raised to 3 root 3 into root 3 is 3 one more root 3 into i raised to 3 minus 1 plus 3 root 3 i minus 3 3 is a 9 i square is minus 1 plus 3 root 3 i raised to 3 is minus i since i square is minus 1 i raised to 3 is i square into i which is minus 1 into i which is i So, minus 1 plus 3 root 3 i minus minus becomes plus 9 plus minus minus 3 root 3 i. See, this is with plus sign minus sign get cancels. So, minus 1 plus 9 is 8 real number. We have to show that this is a real number. So, it is a real number. Proved. Find the value of 3 plus 2 by i. Another bracket. This is multiplied with i raised to 6 minus i raised to 7. Again multiply this with 1 plus i raised to 11. Now we have to find its value. 3 plus 2 by i. First keep it as it is. Then in this term i raised to 6 you can write this as i square this raised to 3, 3 twos are 6, minus i raised to 4 into i raised to 3, base is same, 4 plus 3 is 7, in this bracket 1 plus i raised to 2 raised to 4 into i raised to 3, say so this 2 fours are 8, base is same, four, 8 plus 3 is 11, now this again as it is. Now in this bracket we have to substitute the values of i raised to 3, i raised to 4. So i square we know that it is minus 1. i raised to 3 is i square into i which is minus 1 into i is minus i. And i raised to 4 is i square into i square minus 1 into minus 1 which is 1. Now we have to substitute values of i square i raised to 3 and i raised to 4. i square is minus 1 raised to 3 minus i raised to 4 is 1 into i raised to 3 is minus i close this bracket 1 plus i, raised, I square is minus 1 raised to 4 into 
i raised to 3 is minus i 3 plus 2 by i this minus 1 raised to 3 is minus 1 minus 1 into minus 1 plus 1 again multiply with minus 1 so it will remain it will become minus 1 minus minus becomes plus i this is first bracket in this bracket 1 plus minus 1 raised to 4 so minus 1 raised to 4 is 1 into this minus i 3 plus 2 by i minus 1 plus i now multiply minus plus minus so 1 minus i now 3 plus 2 by i as it is in this bracket multiply this minus 1 with 1 so it will become minus 1 minus 1 into minus i plus i this plus i into plus 1 plus i again plus minus minus i into i is i square so this bracket 3 plus 2 by i in another bracket minus 1 plus 2i minus of minus 1 so minus 1 plus 2i minus of minus 1 because i square is minus 1 becomes plus 1 this minus 1 and plus 1 cancels so this will become 3 plus 2 by i into 2i now Take LCM 3i, multiply this i with 3, 3i plus 2 because nothing is here. So, 1 is here, 2 ones are 2 upon i in 1 multiply, you will get i into 2i. This i cancels with i. Now, multiply this term with 2. So, 2 into 3i plus 2 into 2. See, I am multiplying with this 2 with 3i and this 2 with 2 also. So, it will become 6i plus 4. Evaluate the following. i raised to 35 first. We have to find its value. See, 35 is a big number. First one, i raised to 35. As we know that, i raised to 4 is 1. So, now, I will divide this 35 with 4. Divide this by 4. 4, 8 is 32. This remainder is 3. So, I am writing this as i raised to 4 raised to 8. See, i raised to 4 into 8 outside this bracket. Into i raised to this remainder is 3. Now, add 4 are 32, 32 plus 3 is 35, i raised to 35, same i raised to 35, I can write it as, a, I can write this as i raised to 4 into 8 into i raised to 3. This i raised to 4, we know that this is 1 raised to 8 into i raised to 3 is minus i. So, this will become anything raised to 1 raised to anything is 1 only. So, 1 into minus i, so this is minus i. Now, next one, 1 by i raised to 58. Again, I will write this i raised to 58 as i raised to c, 58. I will divide this with 4. 4 ones are 4. Remainder 1, 4 are. Say this minus 16 so it remainder is 2 so i raised to 4 into 14 into i raised to 2 so this i raised to 4 is 1 1 raised to 14 into i square is minus 1 so this will become anything 1 raised to anything is 1 only 1 into minus 1 which is minus 1
third one i raised to minus 888 this we have to solve this you can write this as i raised to 4 this raised to minus 222 this will become 1 raised to minus 222 which is 1 now fourth one i raised to 30 plus i raised to 40 Plus i raised to fifty plus i raised to sixty. Now this, I'm writing this as i raised to four. This raised to seven. Four sevens are twenty-eight into i square plus i raised to four raised to ten i raised to forty plus. I raised to four. This raised to twelve. Twelve fours are forty-eight into i square, and this term this becomes i raised to fifty. This i raised to four. This raised to fifteen. Fifteen fours are sixty. Now this is equal to i raised to four. We know that this is one raised to seven. I square is minus one. Plus one raised to ten plus one raised to twelve into i square as i square is again minus one. I'm putting its value plus i raised to four is one raised to fifteen. So this is one into minus one minus one one. This is one only one into minus one minus one. Plus one, so this is minus one plus one zero, minus one plus one zero, so this is zero. Answer is zero.